Hi everyone, Dennis Foley from Acoustic Fields. Today we're going to talk about good instincts. So let's take a look at this picture. Came across my desk the other day and I, I said, boy, we got, we got to talk about this. Here's a situation where, you know, obviously a kind of a DIY approach to things, but let's step back a little bit from the treatment and, and look at the, the strategy and, the, and the, the tactics we can discuss later. But, you know, it's amazing effort here. If you look at what's going on, you know, the, the focus is correct. The strategy is correct, treating the front and the sidewalls. It's just that the materials and the technology, if you will, that we use to do that uh, is a little bit uh, not the, the best way to go. So, so we have a good strategy, but our tactics, you know, the, the things that we use to treat the problem are, but leave some to be desired. So front wall, side walls, we know that the front wall is the area of highest pressure. Side walls are the next areas of highest pressure, but all three walls, you know, give us that reflection problem. So we call it the inverted U, you know, that's what it is. Treating the front and both sidewalls, that's what you wanna do. Is our highest pressure area is here. And then our next one, if you had to number them, one, two, three for pressure. Reflection's probably more the other way weighted for the sidewalls, but all three walls need to be treated. So, the treatment in, in this picture, you know, a lot lacks the proper rate and level of absorption. You know, the, the client has the right idea. He understands that hanging sound absorption type materials in those locations has a dramatic impact on the presentation value of a system. He gets that. He understands that. But so we don't know, and, and we see this a lot with DIY approaches. We don't know the rate and level of absorption on the treatment because there's no published data on most of those things that he's using there. So we want to use uh, proper technology that has the proper rates and levels of absorption. What do we got? We know, we know this. Gosh, we've talked about this for forever. Pressure and reflections, right? So let's back up. Let me get out of frame here. Here's our inverted U. So what did we recommend for this? The carbon panel, because his problem started at 40 hertz. Some rooms start at 30, but this one started at 40. So carbon panel along the sides, the front and the sides here. Now the foam face deals with the reflection. The carbon technology on the inside deals with the pressure. So we have pressure and reflection management all in one product. And that's the design of the carbon panel. That's what it's supposed to do. It's strong in that 40 to 6300 range, which is the frequency range that mix engineers work in. That's what's important. We're trying step by step to get closer to the highest resolution that we can. So if we're using treatment that responds to the same frequency range that the, the music was mixed in, we're off to a good start. So we can get some more balance in the situation. Now, the room is going to have its impact, so we're going to have to use more treatment, less treatment. Usually more is the way it goes. But I thought this was a good idea to show you because this person has good instincts. They, they hear the impact of placing sound absorption material types on these surfaces. So the next step then is to refine that strategy and put the proper rate and level of the tactics, the treatment that you're using in the room. So I wanted to share this with you, good instincts, but wrong treatment types. So good strategy, wrong treatment, see it a lot. Hope this helps, thank you. Thank you for watching this video, and if you liked it, please give us a thumbs up. We also have a newsletter that you can subscribe to, so please do that because we offer special price discounts to only those on our newsletter. And then don't forget about our forum. We have started a forum on our own website where people ask questions and I usually get a chance every couple of days to look at it. There's an interchange between people on the forum and we'll give you real answers uh, on a regular basis. So that'll help you. Thank you.